Hello everybody and welcome to my base. This is my fake entrance. There is a trip wire that you can't see. That's why I'm uh, crouching through there. The only thing in this room is Jeff Black saying, fuck you. Hi, everyone. I've killed a lot of people in this room alone. See what I mean? I want to point out <clears throat> my flag is over here and inside the tree and it's below half to give the impression that I haven't been playing in a while. <laughs> Man, you are one pathetic loser. <laughs> there are no windows. As we gain entry through the hidden entrance, <clears throat> excuse me, it's kind of dry in here, you will look up and you will see a killing box on the second level. Once this door is breached with C4, anybody up here defending the door will not be affected. The blast radius stays on the first level. It does not expand upwards. Very strong defensive position. Normally, there is a gate here, a double garage door, tier 3. And the reason for that is to give people defending here the opportunity to kill the intruder. Alright, moving on. Normally, this door here, to actually enter the base, will not have a code lock on it. The person defending this area over here will have a code lock on them. This door will be wide open so they can walk right through. And the reason being, once they come into this room, the guy will put a code lock on this with a code and close the door from the inside, trapping whoever is in That door, and this door, can be closed from just coming the side to side here, trapping them inside. I like it a lot. Now notice, there's a camo net here. You can't really see much more. There's a reason for that. This here is half a circle. These are all triangle floors and foundations. This is our first room. It's pretty nice. This is where we store most of our uh, water and uh, whatever. Now, remember that camo net. One person will be here. One person will be here. And notice that you can't really see down there, but they can't see up either. Now, each of these uh, crates here and the lockers will be full of uh, grenades and smoke grenades. And I mean a lot of them. At least 25 each of each type. 
And once anybody's in this room trapped... You're down there! We're up here! You walked into the wrong goddamn room, Commander! Goddamn it, Commander, one last time. You tell your men to safety their weapons, drop them on the deck. I cannot give that order! I am not gonna repeat that order! I will not give that order! What the hell is wrong with you, man? Stand fast! Oh my god. Let's waste these fuckers. One last time! You order your men to safety their weapons! Notice that pizza wallpaper right there. Well, they're going to be looking like that when uh, the defenders get done with them with grenades. Very, very strong defensive area. Normally these are all tier threes. <clears throat> Nothing in this room. Nothing in this room. Now this is where it gets really interesting. As I stated before, these will be all tier threes. Here's the first main loot room. They will be opening these crates. One by one. And there's nothing but crap loot in here. And I mean... Total crap. Now the reason for this is to lure them here where they, if they misclick, they will spring a trap. They will fall down here and they will, they will die. Um, normally I would have uh, one or two claymores down here with somebody inside this killing box on the second level to trigger it manually and kill whoever falls into the trap. Also, this trap can be sprung from that level as well. I like it a lot. Now, as you see, this is all customized right here. This shelving, it's very, very nice. Here's the next room. Again, there's nothing really in here. Now this is the level where uh, it gets very interesting. This is the, the brain of the entire build. You go on this side. This is where you go and uh, perch up to defend this door, the front door. You can completely walk around here. From all sides. Now normally I do not open that window at all. Due to the fact I don't want anybody seeing this level, of course. So that stays closed. But uh, to anybody raiding, they would get frustrated by now. Because there's nothing here. But there is. Down below is the money room where all the good stuff is.
Now I won't show you what I got. I got news for you, pal. You ain't leading but two things right now. Jack and shit. Tappers, drugs, stuff like that, and collectibles in here. And that's our, uh, our hidden gender room. Now, remember that trap I told you about? This is where they will fall to their death, or fall, be hurt, and then get blown up. And here is where you can spring that door. If you hear people above, spring the trap and make them fall down to their death. And the final room, the key card room. There's nothing really in here. I'm sorry, Dave. This. I'm afraid I can't do that. But uh, that's pretty much it. I hope you guys enjoyed the tour. Pretty cool. You're still here? It's over. Go home. Go.